We're here at the Chengdu uh, East uh, Railway Station, uh, boarding a train for Chongqing. Uh, it is about uh, it's in the uh, afternoon on Thursday, September 25th, 2014. We have to walk all the way down to the end here, the last car. Uh, this is kind of a haul because it's kind of uh, hot and muggy. And uh, also the, uh, the baggage that I'm carrying now is uh, getting uh, rather heavy since I uh, had uh, some sleep deprivation. Well, here we are at the last car. Uh, as you can see, the train's packed. Uh, my seat is right down at the end. Uh, uh, I've got a, uh, as you can see, I've got a, they've got TV here in the uh, in these cars, and I noticed they've got uh, full cell phone service too. So the uh, our adventure starts. We're heading now to. Uh, Jung King, it's going to take about 2 hours and 25 minutes. We're going to stop different places. Uh, I was told that I cannot take uh, a video on the uh, on, on the cars, in the cars, uh, so I'm going to have to uh, sneak a few shots and uh, leave it at that. Uh, the qual I also apologize for the quality of the shots because I'm going to be shooting out windows at a difficult angle. Hundred and fifty six uh, K is about uh, ninety six miles an hour. Ladies and gentlemen, when we arrive at our terminal soon, please check to take all your belongings with you. When you get off the train, 
Well, we're here at Chungking uh, North uh, Railway Station. Again, this uh, is going to be, or is a large uh, railway station. The city has two or three of them. Uh, it's uh, under construction, apparently. Uh, and also, it's a tremendous walk from your train to the front of the station to grab a taxi. To provide you with some uh, uh, factoids about this uh, unknown city to a lot of Westerners, uh, this is the largest uh, municipal population in China. Uh, there's 28 million plus people who live around here. Uh, during the uh, year, there's about 100 days of fog. It's usually referred to as the Fog City. And it's also one of the top 10 most polluted, air polluted cities in the world. Uh, there's a lot of industry going on around here. For example, the largest motorcycle production center is here, uh, and, and uh, it's the largest center in China, probably the world. The largest dam, Three Gorges Dam, uh, which is south of here, supplies unlimited power for economic growth here. Uh, it's a, it, it was just an amazing operation. Uh, this town is at the confluence of the Jialing and the Yangtze River, which makes it one of the more important ports here in uh, China. Uh, a lot of cruises uh, uh, start and end here. Uh, uh, a lot of cargo, bulk cargo, coal and things like that are transported from here. Uh, there's been a lot of direct investment here uh, by a lot of different types of American corporations including Ford, Mazda, uh, HSBC, Citibank, Deutsche Bank, Walmart and many other multinationals. Um, and as a Two other factoids you might not know about is one of the largest of China's iron and ore, um, iron and steel and aluminum production uh, takes place here, and uh, China's the largest deposits of its rare metals and uh, gas fields uh, is located here. So it's a it's a key economic area for uh, China, and uh, it's uh, going to be growing. It appears not to be growing as fast, however, as Chengdu. But again, here's another city in China, a mega city in China, with 28 million plus people, and not only the city plus the surrounding area, which very, uh, very few people in the West know much about. I'm going down here to uh, connect with a cab uh, to my hotel. I understand it's going to be something like about, uh, oh, maybe about a four or five mile ride. Uh, and it's going to cost about uh, 15 bucks, take about 30 minutes depending on the traffic. 